Hello everyone, you're back with me, it's Adam here at Don Amots and today I've got for you a 2014 Coachman Vision 560 stroke 4. So it's a four berth caravan um, with a fixed bed and an end washroom, really, really nice layout and it's in really, really nice condition for its age. You wouldn't think it's a 2014. So we'll have a look around, we'll take around the outside first and we'll go inside and show you the interior. So at the front we've got a big locker, so you've got room for two gas bottles and storage in there as well. Round onto this side, starting at the top, you can see your TV aerial just up there. We've got the vent for your Truma heating, so it's the blown air heating system on this one, and your water intake just there. Leisure battery and hookup point lives just inside that locker there. Down at the bottom, we've got your alloy wheels, and right underneath, you can just see your motor mover down there. So it's great that it's already got a motor mover fitted. Toilet chemical and toilet cassette just in the locker just there. Round onto the back, got window into the bathroom, which I'll show you on the inside. It goes all the way across the back of the van. Really, really nice family layout. Um, onto this side, we've got your awning rail, which goes all the way around, so you can add um, an awning to it. Storage locker, this one goes underneath your bed. Um, I'll show you that on the inside in a minute. So you've got the fixed French bed in this one. Your fridge and freeze events, got the alloy wheels and your motor mover again down there on this side. The maximum weight of the caravan is 1,550 kilos, so if you do want us to do a tow check, make sure your car can tow it, please give us a call and we can check that out within a couple of minutes. And then we've got um, external vent for your Truma heating. We've got a gas barbecue point just there, so you don't have to take your gas bottles up, you can just hook up your Kadak or anything like that straight to the side and enjoy your barbecue. And then we've got a main socket just under there as well, so if you want power outside or in your awning, um, it's great just to plug in just there. So, let's go and have a look inside. In we go. Before we do, we've got your bin on the door, blind on there, and we've got your fly screen as well. So let's go in. Down towards the front of the van, you've got your two benches, great for kids, if you've got the kids coming over to sleep, or it does make up to a double bed as well. We've got loads of storage around the top, on both sides, storage lockers, they're quite generous in size and there's your TV aerial that we saw on the roof. Radio goes just on there, we have got the front in the pack. Uh, like I said you can use these as singles for kids or if you want to make up a bed you can. We've got more storage underneath that along with your boiler drain off and things like that. All your fuses, uh, trips and switches are just down there. And then over onto the other side, that's all storage under there. So you can see loads and loads of storage. And then on the front, we've got your occasional table just pulled out. And then nice deep drawers. All your literature's in there as well. All your user guides and handbooks are just in there. Extra sockets, which is always a bonus. There's a plug socket down there. Over into the kitchen area. We'll start at the top. Loads of storage with your cup holders and plate racks in there. Um, on all your windows, all the way around the van, they all do open and we've got blinds and fly screens on them all. Um, you've got extra plug socket for kettle toaster, anything you might want. Nice big sink. And then we've got the full works on your hob. So we've got three ring gas hob and one electric plate. We've got your separate grill, separate oven, more storage underneath. And then we've got your drawers and more storage in there with your gas isolation valves as well. A little cupboard just to the side there where you've got your freestanding table, so you can use that inside or outside the van. And then carrying on with the kitchen, if we swing over onto this side, nicely stowed away in here, you've got your microwave. Um, so it's all built in, it's, it's tidy, nice little way on there. You've got your vent, uh, vent, sorry, your control panel for your Truma heating, and your TV point just here, so you can plug in 12 volt mains, aerial, you can have it facing the front, or you can turn it around and face the back if you're in bed at the back. And then we've got your three-way fridge um, with freezer compartment at the top. And then this does blind drops down to give you a bit of privacy. And then if you have got the kids or anything in the front, you've got another partition just here, which comes across just to make the bedroom private. Talking of the bedroom, you've got your French bed, really generous size. It lifts up really easy as well. There's loads and loads of storage under here. Look at that drawer that pulls out and then all that is storage under there, you get tables, chairs, all the stuff you'd need um, with your caravan. 
We've got plenty of storage lockers above the top and behind the bed, all the way around. Loads of storage. And then over onto this side, you've got your main wardrobe. So you've got hanging rail at the top. Yep. And then we've got some shelving at the bottom as well. Then we've got a little vanity area here. Nice big full length mirror, which Wendy can see. And then we go through into the bathroom. Yep. So you've got your toilet, hooks for your robes or anything like that. More storage. It's the window we saw from the outside. Nice big sink, mirror, and we've got more stuff for your toiletries in here. And then, right at the end, we've got full-size separate shower. Yeah. Which is always a bonus in a family van. Yeah. So it's in absolutely lovely condition. Um, it's just arrived, it's great for its age. Um, if you've got any questions on it, if you do want to come and see it, my name's Adam, please give me a call. I'm part of the sales team here, and we're all more than happy to help. Thank you.